Hey everybody, Rob here with Smarty Resource. Today I'm going to do a quick video on uh, how to apply a recovery file to your Smarty Touch. Um, recovery files are useful if you're going from an automatic to a manual transmission or vice versa, or uh, say your ECM fries and you have to get a new one, um, they need to be programmed with a VIN number. The, the recovery file can do that for you. And uh, those are available for purchase on uh, SmartyResource.com. Uh, the first step to applying a recovery file uh, is very important. First thing you have to do is return your vehicle to the stock software before you do anything else. So in there it's in the ECM. So let's just say you're starting off from a dashboard. You can go to main menu, ECM, ECM again, and then return vehicle to stock software. And yes, select write the ECM. So once that process is complete, uh, you can pick up uh, at the SD card and getting that file, the recovery file under your SD card, which I'll show you here in a few minutes. Okay, so we're back inside. Um, I got the SD card put into the computer. Um, so I'm gonna show you real quick just how to start off a recovery file, um, how, to, how to obtain one. So the first thing, you go to smartyresource.com And then you need to go to support. You're going to open up a support ticket. And this is going to be under paid service uh, unless you've made some other arrangement for whatever reason. Um, so it says there are $120. You're going to hit new request. And this is the most important part here is uh, you want to click Smarty Recovery and that will take you to the screen that will uh, ask you all the information about your truck and uh, most importantly will take you to the payment screen uh, after this and that will create a request um, and uh, we'll get that sent off to the programmers and then what will come back is your recovery file on that ticket system. It'll almost be like an email with an attachment on it um, and you're going to download that file so just for the interest of saving time I've already downloaded this file uh, right here on my desktop and you're going to use a program called 7-Zip which is also available on the smartyresource.com website um, to unzip this. So you just right click it, go down to 7-Zip and we're going to extract it um, to that directory. The directory is the same name as a file up there. Okay, so there we go. And what you're going to get is a recovery.s2g file, which again, we're going to right click, copy, and we're going to go down to the SD card, Smarty SD card and you're going to go into data and you're going to paste it. And I already have one in there so it's asking me if I want to replace it. Yes I do, but you will not get that uh, message there. So when you're done you should have a file at the bottom that looks like this recovery.s2g in your uh, SD card. At that point you need to go up to the SD card root there, right click and eject and now you can physically remove the SD card from your computer and take it out to the truck. Once you've got the uh, recovery file copied to the data folder of your SD card you can come back out um, put the SD card back in your touch you will start everything up go to main menu ECM and that will be the only option that you get at that point um, is write recovery. And then you get a little bit different uh, set of instructions than when you're applying a tune, but fairly easy, straightforward. All you got to do is follow the instructions there.
All right, so right there, mine ended in an error because I've already used these recoveries. Uh, just loaded them on the SD card to give you a uh, an overview of what it looked like. Um, had that been an actual fresh recovery, um, it would have taken you through the uh, the programming right there. It would actually flash your truck, and then uh, you can uh, go from there. You'd be at a a stock setting, uh, either having gone from you know one an, an old ECM to a new ECM or uh, an automatic to a manual transmission or vice versa um, and once you're back in that stock configuration you can uh, you can tune uh, like normal you could either write a, uh, a can tune off the smarty touch at that point or you can apply uh, one of your custom tunes so hopefully you found this helpful if you did please go ahead and hit the subscribe button um, leave me some comments below uh, if you have any uh, anything to say about the video or any questions uh, if you have any problems with this please go to smartyresource.com uh, look through the forums there for an answer. If you cannot find an answer there, please go ahead and open up a trouble ticket and uh, one of us will be along shortly to, to see how we can assist you.